Let's go. Hey folks, it's Grimwit. This is Gary's Mod. This is Grimwit in Gary's Mod. I uh <laughs> I I'm re-recording. I did a wonderful little view of a, a tour of a beautiful map, but uh, I can't show it to you. Yay, there we go. It's open. Uh, the the reasons... Oh, oh, okay. Um, so, one, the, the map was Christmas-themed uh, and uh, had too many N-words. Uh, words like nautical, uh, never, uh, no rad, and... Um, so I can't show you that map <laughs> to the point where me and one of the viewers of my Twitch uh, were trying to determine whether or not the creator of the map <laughs> was black. So let's not talk about that, eh? Uh, instead, uh, let's just do a quick uh, rundown of this really good map. Re really good map. I'm seeing some quality here, but this map is surprisingly fun. So let's go on a ride at the Jurassic Park theme park. Ju Jurassic Park theme park. Jurassic theme park. Look, I believe this is supposed to be a ride for the Universal Studios Jurassic Park in Florida. Maybe? Anyway. Um, let's take a look around first. As is per our normal, though there aren't many custom assets. The one custom, the, the custom assets that they have here, are prime, prime. Uh, we are mixing it, however, with a little bit of jank, just a little bit of jank. Uh, so what is? Let me let me actually look. I gotta look up the the name of this map again so that I can get it right. Right. Uh, this is RP underscore Jurassic underscore Park underscore Ride underscore V two which came out relatively recently. And I highly recommend it, but it's kind of a one-trick pony. Uh, here we are in the, uh, the souvenir shop, but as you can see, they're sold out of almost everything. I think I saw a glow back there. We'll come back to that later when we do a closer tour. You know, when I think of Jurassic Park, I think of tanks, don't you? Let's get into the ride. I have changed my model a little bit. Um, for no other reason than, eh, I was just getting tired of it. <clears throat> so now I have a model that can uh, truly uh, represent my, my inner person. Hell yeah. All right. The lines are real long. Remember Cartman Land? It's an episode of South Park where Cartman buys a theme park just so he doesn't have to wait in lines. All right. Uh, the audio assets, I think, are stolen straight from the uh, the ride itself. Uh, can I actually... Can, can I get over there? Can I jump? Can I jump that? Hang on. Oh my god, I can actually get over here. Hell yeah. Now, just walking into the car, like pressing E on the, the ship will get it started. But that's no fun. Let's do this the wrong way. Oh, uh, I guess it's not starting without me. So, fine. <laughs> God damn. Oh no. I've. Help me, I'm trapped. Okay, we're good. <laughs> What? What is happening? <laughs> Can I climb up that? I cannot. All right, cool. This is, this is going great. Great now, so all right. <laughs> I broke it. I fucking broke it. I can't believe I've broken the, this game again. <laughs> Oh no, it's getting worse. <laughs> Alright, oh, whoa. Alright, uh, that was nifty. Uh, and not just the little cleaning devil nifty. Alright, there we go. Quick run. Oh no, no, what, what, I'm run. I'm. My ride! 
Okay, there we go. We're good. It's all good. There's nothing janky about this map. There's nothing janky about it at all. You're you're wrong about the jank. Okay, good. A little worried. I hope you guys are ready for an incredible ride. Ride maps in Gary's Mod are kind of rare because, uh, well, uh, they're fine for me, but most people don't like them. See, I, I play Mercy in Overwatch because I don't like to do anything. Uh, and it, it still gets me in the game. Maybe Reinhardt, too. Point being is, uh, most people want to do stuff. Oh, huh? hey, we have music. Newborn world, guys. This world is underage. Be mindful. Oh my god, they have animatronic dinosaurs. This is so fucking cool, you guys. That one looks like he's stuck in the mud. Except stepping on us. Can you guys even hear that? Like I can't I can't increase the volume. There's nothing I can do. Looks like pee. There is no jank in this map. You're wrong. There's no jank. That was a cow. I don't have to do anything in this map. This is great. But we we can't. We're just oh. Let's sit. Uh-oh. I, I mean, I could get out of the boat. Look at Look at Oh no. What's up, buddy? What's up? There's nothing wrong with the map. Ah! Oh no! Ah! It's a good thing cars float an inch off of the water. I'm poisoned now. I can't see. Good job. I've been blinded. Can you imagine the animatronic thing actually meant to squirt actual acid into your face? Your eyes open. Are in the splash zone. Ow. 
Ah! At least we're going forward, right? We're still gonna go forward. No, no, oh no! Ah! I can never play patty cake with that one. Nice thing about fighting T-Rexes is their short arms make their reach really terrible when you're fencing them. They can barely hold a sword, if I'm honest. It's sort of unfair. Mm-hmm. Neat. Um, okay. Ah! Oh, no! Okay, we're good now. And this is, you know, where the observers will spray all over you with their wet tips. Just, yeah. Some of them nautical men. That's right. Seamen are, is involved. Uh, gosh, that sound stopped abruptly. I guess we're okay now. Is the conceit that we've been eaten? Uh, okay, super important if you play this map. Uh, once Wait until the boat comes to a complete halt. Keep your arms and legs inside the boat at all times. I will show you why. But uh, don't get out of the boat. Do not. Do not get out of the boat. Just sit here and wait. <clears throat> Take a sip of Dr. Pepper Zero. Uh, this uh, stream is not sponsored by Dr. Pepper Zero. But if it were, that would be lovely. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, this this should work. It'll it will work. Just gotta be patient. Did I screw it up? Cause I mean, it should work. Cool. Okay, and on, on these rare occasions when something goes wrong, then you can get out of the boat. Am I just not being patient? No, no, we'll get out of the boat. Okay, it wasn't supposed to go down like that. It it wasn't, but it did, and now here we are, and we got to live with it. Uh, these stairs <clears throat> lead us through uh, Black Mesa facility and into um, the gift shop. See, isn't that great? That's great. I love that. That's great. That's a nice touch. Because that's, that's how the ride would go, right? And I don't know if this is meant to be like a one-to-one -one scale. Um, let me show you real quick why you should not get out of the boat. Uh, and then we'll just kind of take a look around. Okay, that's one reason. Uh, another reason is if you start it, like if you, if you, hmm. oh no, I'm stuck. There we go. If you start it and then get out of the boat and get in the way of the boat. Oh, it didn't do it this time. I wonder why it did it last time. It will fucking kill you. Uh oh. Well, I'm going to count this as revenge for the times that it killed me, so. Take that, boat. I'm actually really impressed that it didn't kill me this time. So let's wander. There is a door back here. Um, that we passed up. Most doors lead to nowhere, but this particular one you may recognize as soon as I get to the other side of it. 
I don't know what this button does. I don't know what this button does. I've pressed it. I don't... It beeps. It, it gives a beep. But I don't know what, it, what it's doing. Okay, here we go. So, uh, that is obviously where the T-Rex comes from. Uh, a fun thing about this map is there is so much of it that is just not real at all. Like, at all. Like, there's so much of it that you can clip through without choosing to clip through anything. Uh, sure. Messy eater. The raptor. Oh, there's the raptor. Hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing down there? You doing okay? Want a soda? Want a, want a steak? Aren't raptors supposed to be chicken size? I'm pretty sure they are. Okay, uh, we have this, we have this, we have this ladder. Uh, this ladder is super important because it doesn't, it does not, it's not really there. Nothing's really there. Somebody pointed to that cross, cross pointed this out, uh, that there was a ladder and he wanted me to kind of explore the place and he was given good places to explore. Um, and we kept running into this problem, that there are things that just don't have any kind of geometry, right? Oh, God, this, including this boat. Cool. But they have, like, spots, right? Which is kind of cool that they do that. Like, they, there, there is stuff to explore. You just can't touch it. Uh, like, okay, these stairs are a great example. These stairs work. That's great. Um, these stairs work. That's great. And both of these st stairs, they're, they're fine. These stairs work. What is it? These stairs? Yeah, these stairs work, and they're just out of the picture. And since you're coming up from this direction, you see that they're just kind of flat planes. Because you weren't meant to go back here, right? This isn't the place you're meant to be. Can I get into this boat? I cannot. This isn't real. It's not even my real mom. None of it's real. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, I can just go through the rocks. That's cool. That, that makes sense, I guess. As much sense as anything. Ah! I'm stuck. So, that's Jurassic Park Ride. Uh, small map. Prone to shenaniganery, but ultimately a fun map. Uh, play it with your friends. And, um... So, this, this was a short episode. I don't really feel the need to do more than one map an episode. You know what, though? Let me do another map. I'm going to show you a map that I've been keeping in my back pocket because there's nothing to the map. There's no details. But it is something of a marvel of Gary's Mod map making. And that is the train map. Hang on a second. Do, do, here we go. This is GM Train Ride version 1. Uh, I will do the nighttime. Daytime is great to see everything. You know, I'll do daytime so you can see it. But GM Train Ride, all one word, V1, is a masterpiece, kind of. They didn't do... Well, you'll see. Let, let it load. And you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. So welcome to GM Train Ride. Uh, this is a tech demo. This is to see if they could do it. Uh, whoever they are. I'll have to look up the, who wrote this map, actually. Who wrote this map? Very sad. Train ride, train ride. Where's the train ride? I'm showing off too much too fast, aren't I? Here we go, though. Uh, so this map was done by... Uh, Iosif. I-O-S-I-F. And I want to bring this name up particularly, and I'm willing to kind of expose all the maps I have 
Although, please, please leave suggestions for maps that I haven't played, maybe. Because I love maps. I love good maps. And some ship post maps. Okay. So. We're riding a train. And the train, if you've noticed, is still going. The train's still going. And we've got the scrolling outside. Uh, we're in some kind of ravine. And the, the train is still going. Therein kind of lies the issue, right? How is this train still going? How big is this map? Is this one of those infinite map uh, mods? It is not. This train, this train map can work without any extra add-ons. You don't need special assets for this map. You don't need a special mod. You can just download Gary's mod and instantly open up this map and start playing. So what are they doing? How is this possible? And that's the beauty of this map. That's the masterpiece. Uh, it's actually, can I, can I reach over there? Yeah, you can even glide on some of the trains. I can do that train too, but it'll become really obvious. Uh, you you can get knocked off the train if you if you try. So I'm not going to try. Oh, uh, I actually can, can I get back there? Uh, uh oh. Um, okay, okay. So may, maybe not the best. All right, so I'm dead. Uh, uh, so back to it. Anyway, so how is it doing this? Well, I'll tell you, my friend, how it's doing this very very clever trick. This train that I'm on right now, this is perfectly still. This train is not moving. The world around the train, that's what's, that's what's actually moving. And you can do some neat tricks with this, right? So let's actually go up here real quick. Ah, fuck! There we go. All right. Um. Oh. Oh no. Ah fuck. So. All right. So maybe I'm not great at this. <laughs> fuck me. Uh. But okay. Um. This leads to some interesting tricks, and it has to do more with how the map was put together. Um. The outside world. That's got geometry. That's that is something that you can. Uh, encounter like you you can land on some of the houses for example can I, can I try that now you can get crushed by that train right there um, the uh, the stuff that's coming this way is also uh, solid solid enough as you saw to knock me off a train and kill me instantly everything is instant death here so you could pull off some kind of train heights if you're willing to uh, whoop, put on some some stuff it takes a while to repeat too. Uh, these side areas, they're, they're very well mapped, but this isn't moving. The train I'm on isn't moving. Isn't that cool? That's so clever. That's so goddamn clever. So let's take a look. Let's no clip out of this map real quick. This is what the map actually looks like, right? Um... One of the things you can do, God, that's that gives me a little bit of vertigo trying it. Uh, one of the things you could do is you can ride that train that's slowly going by. Here it comes again because it, it repeats, right? You can ride it, and if you ride it all the way to the edge of the map, it will start pushing you off because the train is scrolling through the edge of the map. But that's that's how they did it. Can I? Let's. Ah, I can't, I actually cannot keep up with this. You know, I don't have to. Let's, uh, can I, can I jump on top of this water tower? No, I guess not. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's, it's really hard to, uh, fall into the geometry. Oh, that's, that's easy, because it's long. There we go. And so we can just be on here as it's scrolling off of the map. And as it scrolls off, I, I won't touch the keyboard. It'll push me off if I wait long enough. 
Here it comes, and I'm off. I really like this map. I visit it every so often. And for no other reason than to just marvel at how well Iosif did this. Like, it's so good. And I haven't seen this. This is unique. I haven't seen another map pull stuff like this off. I mean, this is clever enough. You can put this as, like, an in-between, right? And then set a timer as people will go from one map or one level of a map to another. That's good. That's really good. You don't. You also don't have to worry about when VR... Ha uh, when you're playing Gary's Mod VR and you go onto a moving vehicle, uh, weird things happen to your camera. And that doesn't happen here. And they did well enough to change the ambient sound whenever you're inside or outside of a train car. That's a good, that's a good touch. The car itself is pretty boring. Um, like, the inside of the train is pretty boring. There's not a whole lot of detail. I'm not worried about it, because it makes up for it in uh, creativity of just how to get this to work. Um that I'm not going to worry about the authenticity of, of falling into an illusion of being in a train car and sitting down across from your passenger and, and eating a donut. So, all right. I'm going to go ahead and stop it here with this, this train stuff going on in the background. Uh, really good map. Very good map. Train ride. GM underscore train ride. Look it up. Um, you know what? If you feel so obliged, if you know some Gary's Mod maps that you'd like me to take a look at, I, I'm always for it. Uh, I still have a backlog of these things, and uh, we met the subscription count. I asked for 500. It turns out that I had 700, so th sticking in that theme, I'm going to require, uh, to do another one of these videos, I'm going to require a number of views uh, for this video. So just spread the word and get people to view this, and I need it... Like, uh, negative five views. If you can get negative five views on this, which will put us in a view debt, and we will end up owing views, right? But if you can get me uh, negative views on this, that would be excellent. You know, I'll, no, no, a negative five views, I think is pretty good. So if I get over negative five views, I'll do this again. All right, everybody have a, uh, a wonderful night, and... Uh, don't be racist. Ta!